Patrick Mahomes will be the greatest quarterback of all time. Mark my words. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Alec Upchurch. I say that simple and concise sentence, but with that simple and concise sentence comes a big, big, shall we say, theme of what I think one player will be in the future and what he will be considered in the future. Well, the reason I say that is simple. There's no other quarterback in NFL history to have as much ability as Mahomes. Mahomes can rush. There's, I mean, he's very athletic. People don't give him credit for his athletic ability. He can throw the ball as far as possible. His arm strength is insane. He's insanely accurate. There's nobody that's accurate as him. There's no other quarterback in NFL history to start out as fast, to take, I mean, he already got a Super Bowl already. In the past three seasons, he's been to the AFC Championship. One time against the Patriots, lost. Went back to the, to the Super Bowl. Went to the Super Bowl the first time, rather. Won, and the second time went back to the Super Bowl. I mean, the Chiefs, with Mahomes alone, are a Super Bowl contender. One thing about Tom Brady is that during you know the greatest of all time, as he's considered, Tom Brady, at one point in time needed more of the team around him to win the games for him. He had a great, and I'm speaking of 2001, when they beat the St. Louis Rams in the Super Bowl, when Adam Vinatieri hit the field goal. Tom Brady was not a Mahomes quarterback. Mahomes, what makes him great is, you take Patrick Mahomes off the Kansas City Chiefs, Kansas City, still a playoff team, not a Super Bowl contender. If you took Brady off that 2001 team, I still think... Because people forget, Brady got hurt in the AFC Championship game. They had Drew Bledsoe. Bledsoe played, and they won that game against the Pittsburgh Steelers, the 2001 AFC Championship game, one of the Super Bowl. You take Tom Brady off that Patriots team, I still think they have a shot. Maybe do they beat the St. Louis Rams, the greatest show on turf with Kurt Warner, Isaac Bruce, Marshall Falk, those guys, Torrey Holt? Probably not. But here's the thing. Mahomes is the greatest as of right now. You take him off that Chiefs team, they're not as good. That's the difference. Brady, when he was young, you know, obviously with Brady going to Tampa Bay, that proves his greatness. But with Mahomes and Brady, especially Brady, Brady, you take him off that 2001 team, and you take him off the team early, I still think the Patriots will have some success. And I even think they'll have, if Mahomes goes off the Kansas City Chiefs, they might have some success. But they won't be Super Bowl caliber teams. That just won't happen. Mahomes has all the ability. No one has started out as sensational as Patrick Mahomes. Nobody. That's the difference. Brady, you know, he started out okay. You know, but not like Mahomes. Nobody has. We're talking Terry Bradshaw. Um... You know, Joe Namath, Joe Montana, John Elway, Dan Marino. Granted, Dan Marino did because in 1984, he threw for over 5,000 yards. And that's in 1984. But that's it. That's maybe the only quarterback that started out as fast. Mahomes got a Super Bowl MVP, a league MVP, and he's second. Last year, he was second in MVP voting. Aaron Rodgers just edged him out. And you can make an argument he could have been MVP last year. Greatness, ladies and gentlemen. Mahomes in 2045, mark my words. In 2045, when there's flying cars, hopefully, when there's flying cars and you're in your flying car, come back to this video. Tom Brady will be considered Bill Russell, but Patrick Mahomes will be considered Michael Jordan.